What's up, Kingdom Kids? It's your girl, Yada, and I'm here with a word from our good father. Yes, your father has sent me with another word, y'all. I don't know who needs this, but God says somebody needs this message, so I come through to bless the kingdom, okay? Listen, if you're new here, hi. Welcome, welcome, welcome. We welcome you to be a part of this family. So don't leave without hitting that subscribe button that way you never miss a video, okay? And if this message blesses you in any way, feel free to hit the like button. And if the Holy Spirit will lead you to, don't leave without comment or sharing a video, all right? We definitely want to share the video, guys. We want to make sure this reaches whomever the Lord intends for it to reach. Amen. All right, now, family, listen, I have already prayed and welcomed the Lord in and welcomed the Holy Spirit and, you know, set the tone here, y'all. Father God, I still ask that you use me, speak through me, Lord Jesus. I'm your vessel. Speak to your children, God. Make sure this word is delivered the way that you intended in Jesus' name. Amen. All right, now, y'all, listen, I don't know who needs this thing, but God says somebody needs this message, so I pray that it reaches you. I pray that it comforts you. I pray that it encourages you, and I pray that it blesses you. In Jesus' name, all right, y'all, listen, still get the word back before God in prayer and test the spirit family. But whoever this is for, this is going to be just what you need, okay? So God is saying right now, guys, he said things are working together for your good, okay? I don't know who this is for, but God said he needs you to know that things are working together for your good. Listen to this. I don't know who this is for, but this is going to, baby, this is going to activate your spirit, okay? God said right now, you're probably saying right now, you're like, God, why am I still here? Okay, it is one thing after another. Okay, you like, I'm tired of being sick and tired. I don't know who to trust. I Listen, I'm losing thing after thing. Listen, my, I've lost everything but my life at this point. Okay, some of y'all like, listen, I've lost everything but my life. Come on now. God say y'all to tell them they have not lost me. I don't know who you are. I don't know what you're going through, what you're facing right now. But your father said you have not lost him. And I want you to know, no matter what you go through, baby, as long as you got the father, as long as you got, listen, what they say, as long as I got King Jesus, baby, you have more than enough. Amen. You have more than enough. I don't know who you are. God said right now, he said, I need you to stand on kingdom business. Listen to me. He said, I need you to stand on kingdom business. He said, because I'm trusting you with these troubles. I don't know who this is for. I know that's probably not what you want to hear. But God said, baby, you are my, you, listen, you're my super servant. Remember, he said, I am trusting you with these troubles. Will you remain loyal? Will you remain faithful? God said, can I, can I, can I depend on you? Okay, to, to keep your integrity through these trying times. I don't know who this is for, baby, but God said, I don't know. He said, baby, this, this, he said, right now, I want to know during these trying times, during the storm, can he trust you with the troubles? Okay, this is, this is when you really find out. This is when you really find out, okay, what that fate do, okay? God say, are you really about that Christ life? I know, we be, so, we be so hard up for the blessings. Come on now. Can we handle the burdens, okay? Can you handle the troubles? I know I know you want the testimony. You want double for your trouble. Can you handle the troubles? Can God trust you with the troubles? Will you remain loyal? Will you remain faithful? Can you handle the troubles? I don't know who this is for, but God say, are you really about that Christ life? Come on now. God say, are you really about that Christ life? I don't know who this is for, baby, but if you feel that thing in the spirit, come on, say, I'm about that Christ life. Come on now. If you feel that thing, who is the Lord speaking to the day? God say, are you really about that Christ life? Can he trust you with troubles? Can God trust you with troubles? Come on now. Somebody say, I'm about that Christ life. I will not give up because it's hard. Come on now. I'm telling you, God say, baby, during these trying times, I don't care who it is, baby. God say, times will always be trying, okay? Can he trust you with troubles, baby? I don't care if you anoint it. it, it baby, to times be trying to anoint it, the chosen. Listen to me. God say, my beloved, life gone life no matter what. Can God trust you with troubles? Come on now. Who this thing is for right here? Come somebody say, God, I'm about that Christ life. Come on now. I am about that Christ life, God. You can trust me with troubles. I will remain faithful. I will remain loyal in Jesus name will you remain committed come on now will you remain committed I don't know who this is for but God said baby he said you cannot rebuke what I have sent 
Listen to this. God say, baby, you're facing this because I, I thought I think you can get through. It. I know you can. Thank you, Lord. God say, I know you can get through this. I'm trusting you with these troubles. I'm trusting you to get through this thing, baby. Listen, no, no, listen. Don't, don't give up on God. Don't give up on yourself and God. God say you can get through this. I don't know who you are. God said, baby, he said, you wouldn't be facing this if I didn't think you could get through it. You wouldn't be facing this if I didn't think. He said, I'm betting on you. Come on now. God said, you are my investment, baby. He said, I'm betting on you. Come on now. God said, stay committed, baby. Stay faithful. I don't know who you are, baby. God said, baby, I know it don't feel good. I know it may not look good, but he is still good. Amen. He said God is still good because God is good, baby. You know that things are working for your good. Amen. God said stand on kingdom business. Remember, y'all, stand on kingdom business and stand on the word of God. Amen. God said stand on kingdom business. Keep it kingdom even during trying times. Can you keep it kingdom during trying time, baby? That's going to expose your faith level, okay? That will, the way you the way you serve, the way you praise, the way you worship, the way you, you know, speak. God said that during trying times, when you're going through the storms, when you're going through trouble, that exposes your faith level. It ain't about how you manage the blessing. How do you manage troubles? Woo, that old oh, baby. How do you manage when you're going through? Come on now. How do you manage then? That's when God, listen, God looking for the servant that can manage when the troubles hit. When a storm is upon you, can you still worship him? When you still worship him, God said, that's the servant I'm looking for. I don't know who this is for. God say, but hey, baby, I sent that. You can't rebuke what I have sent. Amen. He said, and I sent it because I felt like I can trust you with these troubles. Can God trust you with the troubles? I don't know who this is for, but can God trust you? Come on, somebody say, God can trust me. God, you can trust me with these troubles. Come on now. I was praying about it. I was going to give up. I was saying it was too much, but God, because you betting on me. I know if you betting on me, baby, I ain't got nothing to lose. Come on, somebody say, God, you can trust me with these troubles. Can God trust you with the troubles? I don't know who this is for, baby, but if it's for you, speak that thing out your mouth. Type that thing out. Say that thing out loud. Get it in your subconscious mind. Say, God can trust me with these troubles. Come on, tell your father. Let him know. Say, God, you can trust me with these troubles. Come on now. We can't always just be looking for the blessing. We can't always just be looking for the, 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 the blessing. Come on now. God say, will you, can you handle the burdens? Come on now. When life starts life, and baby, will you still worship me? Come on now. Will you still call out to me? Come on now. Will you still praise my name? Will you still glorify me? Come on, God say, will you still go on a narrow road? Come on now. Will you still, can you, can you keep your integrity? Can you, can, can you keep your integrity? Will you remain loyal? Will you remain faithful? When things get hard, when your back is up against the wall, when you don't know where to go, will you still lean on the word of God? Come on now, will you keep it kingdom? I'm telling you, God said, baby, keep it kingdom. Even during trying times, I don't know who this is for. I don't know if this is something you're going through right now or something you're about to face because this is a prophetic word. But I want you to know, baby, whenever this trouble comes, whenever trying times hit you, baby, because trying times are always trying. Either it's trying you now, it just recently tried you, whatever, or whatever, you're about, about to start trying you. Whenever times are trying, come on now, whenever times are trying, you better know, baby, God, you better let your father trust you. God sent it and he better be able to trust you with it, okay? You be, he better be able to trust you with it. God better be able to trust you with those troubles. Listen, y'all, let me give y'all some scriptures and I'm going to let y'all go, okay? Listen, I love y'all so much. I don't know who needed this thing today, but I pray that it reaches you. I pray that it comforts you and encourages you, amen, okay? That you have all that you need to get through this thing. God is betting on you to get through this, okay? All right, y'all, listen. Listen, y'all, God led me to Job 2, 6. Again, it's Job 2, verse 6. It said, the Lord said to Satan, very well then, he is yours. I'm sorry, he is in your hands, but you must spare his life, okay? And then if we jump down to verse 10, it says, shall we accept good from God and not troubles? This is Job speaking to his wife who's telling him to curse God's name. Okay, so God is saying right now, he has all, He has authorized Satan to touch everything he has touched in your life. God says, so you like God, it's one thing after another. Say, God say, fine, I am still here with you. I am still here for you. Show Satan, baby, I can lose it all. You can touch everything, baby, but as long as I have God, I am good. Okay, and like Job said, that we can't only accept good from God and not troubles. Can God trust you with those troubles? 
okay? Can God trust you with those troubles? God is looking for some servants that he can trust with troubles. Because if God can't trust you with troubles, baby, when, when life start life, you're going to be ready to give up. And God don't need no servant, baby. He ain't looking for nobody to give up. He looking for some people to sit out into war, baby, into battle. And when you in battle, God need to be able to trust you, baby. He want to be able to trust you on the mission. God need to be able to trust you on the mission that you're going to stay focused and you won't turn your back on him. Amen. God say, will you remain loyal and faithful during a trying time? I don't know who needs this thing, but I want you to know that your father is with you. Okay. And he is betting on you. Amen. Listen, I love y'all. I pray that this word reaches whomever it's intended to reach and it comforts you and it blesses you. Okay. Listen, I love y'all so much. I love you with the love of God. Thank y'all so much for the comments, the love, the shares, the new subscribers. Hey family, listen, thank you for the followers on TikTok. I see y'all. I see y'all. Listen, thank you for the, the, the emails of encouragement. I have received you guys a prayer request. Okay, I have been responding too. So listen, the Holy Spirit has been leading me to respond a lot more. I've been putting more time into the ministry. Okay, thank God. Okay, and I thank him. All praise and, and, and honor goes to him. Okay, I thank you guys for the seeds that you have been sowing, the donations, the gifts that you guys have been sending. I thank you. I thank you, y'all. It is so hot out here. But I thank you, okay? I thank you. I thank you. I thank you. Look, I'm looking for a, a paper towel or something, but I'm almost son but i just wanted to say i thank you guys okay i thank you for giving into the mission giving into the ministry okay giving to the family i thank you for your generosity you have no idea how you're going to make the word of god come to pass through this ministry what this what god is going to do through this family i thank you and god thank you even if it's your time we thank you for sowing your time here with us amen all right guys i pray that god will send it back to you a hundredfold okay so get ready all right get ready for God to increase and multiply what you have put out there okay all right y'all listen I thank you so much I love y'all go out and live a blessed life you know a blessed life comes from first being a blessing